I am Renee, one of the woundostomy nurses here on the Me Plus team at Convitec. In this video, I am going to provide tips for measuring your patient's stoma through telehealth and video tools. It may seem difficult at first, but with these helpful tips, I know you're going to find success. Before we get started, you can find all the measuring guide tools that I will speak about today and show you at convitec.com slash ostomy slash guide. That's convitec.com slash ostomy slash guide. Let's get started. Your patient may have one of our measuring guides that they've received either in a uh, product sample or in their starter kit. The most common you'll find is this one white one with several different holes in it. There's also our moldable guide, which looks like this, almost the same. It does have a lot of colors to it, so it helps them determine the size. And if they don't have that option, um, there is an option to print an, a measuring guide from our website at Compotech.com slash ostomy slash guide. And it's gonna look something like this. If they don't have an ostomy measuring guide, that's okay. We're gonna talk in a few moments about a coin analogy and I'll show you how that can be used. So the first step for them is to make sure that they have removed their old appliance and that their peristomal skin has been cleaned. After that, what they're going to do is take a measuring guide and look at the different sized holes and find the one that closest matches their stoma size. Once they determine what they think is their stoma size, they'll just take that hole, slide it over their stoma, and what should happen is it should slide over the stoma without touching it, so getting as close as it can, but not touching. If the stoma is oval, then that is the widest point on their stoma. Then they will take a hole that is narrower, smaller hole, to measure that narrower side of the stoma, and then they will have the widest and the um, narrower side. Then again, if they don't have a measuring guide, they can use our stoma coin analogy and measurements. Very simple for them to use. What they would do is you would say, is your stoma about the size of a dime? So they would find a dime, measure their stoma next to it, you know, just kind of putting the dime next to the stoma to see if they're about the same size. If, it's, if they say it's a little bit bigger, then ask them to try a quarter and see if that will work. If it's a quarter size, it's about an inch. So the numbers are comparable to what their stoma would be and you'd have a good idea of what it was. That's it. I hope these simple directions will help you explain steps to your patients so they can accurately measure their stomas on their own. Again, you can find all of these tools at Convitec.com slash ostomy slash guide. And remember, there are certified ostomy nurses like myself here at Convitec on the Me Plus team, as well as product specialists. You can get in touch with us by calling 1-800-422-8811. We're here Monday through Friday, 8.30 to 7 o'clock Eastern Time. We look forward to hearing from you and have a wonderful day.